good afternoon. The afternoon is actually the evening. Welcome back to my channel. Two uploads in a week. Carol, what are you saying? Um, so for those of you that follow me on Instagram, you are going to know that my family arrived today from the UK. They've come to visit me, which is uh, so exciting. So today I have had lots of gifts. Lots and lots. So I asked my sister to bring me some bits over for Instagram for my spring decor. New house, I haven't done spring decorating here yet, which excites me. But I did also go, my mum also brought me some bits out, which I'm going to show you all now. Um, and I have to film this video tonight because it's all stacked up in my office and I want to get it out like I want to style it and I want to get it all out um, but I did before that I had to kill time so I may have gone and done a little bit of shopping with Faith but I just want to show you that also because I got some real bug in just down just down here pickle so uh, Okay, that's a big pile of stuff that she just threw at me. So the first place I went to was, I went into Rotonda. Rotonda? Rotonda? Or oh, whatever, it's a big shopping centre. But I went into New Yorker and I bought this, like, well, I'll show you how long it is. I went into, uh, there, that would be me wearing it. How do I look? I bought this cardigan, it's like a nude and a really thin knit. I've got the ring light on so it might be slightly annoying. It has pockets and it's like just kind of below the knee but it was reduced from 20 euros to 9 euros. But it's just like I think I got it in XL. <laughs> I got it in XL. But it's comfy. I have got, guys, I have got this idea of what I want to wear. Hear me out. Nude, no, for like white bodysuit, but like lycra-y, no bra. Um, white trousers fitted, like kind of tailored, but skinny fit. Nude heels, cardigan. I want to feel like a Latino woman. And to me, maybe I might wear tight back ponytail with massive shades. That's how I'm feeling. So yeah, this is this is my first bargain, nine euros. And then, right guys, these were reduced from oh no, where's the tag gone? Oh man, they don't even look that big anymore. Okay, there are forty. We might be. I didn't rip them. That was a zip. We might be all right. So they are grey leather look, skinny trousers, but with the. With the little zip on the on the bottom, you see. Now I live in the Canary Islands. It's hella hot all the time. So leather look trousers are not, and they're like fleece lines. It's not pretty inside the trousers, but I think it'll be a vibe. I can't remember what these started off at, but they were reduced to four ninety nine. Maybe it's because us girls in the Canaries shouldn't be wearing leather look trousers. Right, the next place that I went was the China shop. You guys hear me talk about the China shop all the damn time. It is just like the biggest, randomest shop ever, but everything is so cheap. So I bought these little things here, like, I'm a sucker for foliage. I can't help it. If it's green and got a little bit of white on, it's mine. It's going home with me. They could have told me today that these were £24.99 each. And I'd have been like, get me four. Because that's what I would have done. But they were one forty nine each. So I picked up. <laughs> four. How springy is that? Now, I'm not going to lie to you girls. These little white things here... Oh god, I don't know if it's going to focus. No, it's probably not. They look like the end of genitalia. Not mine or your genitalia, but possibly the person that you sleep next to. That's what it looks like. 
Not that fatty, obviously. Sorry, <laughs> but but yeah, that's what it looks like. So one forty nine a stem. I can't do the math, but they are cute, right? In a jar, like a white jug. Oh, love them. So next, there's a mound of clothes down there that my sister's brought me, but we're not doing that. I'm just going to show you all the goodness. So. <laughs> Now this needs a little bit of surgery, but this Easter basket, guys, I can't remember if it's B&M or Poundland or Pound Stretcher, but in transit, obviously this poor guy had to get from Bristol Airport to Fortaventura, so he lost his eye, but we can fix that. Also, we need to take this blue strap off because that's not... We don't like that. But the basket, I can't even tell you how much it is because my sister says, I'll get it, I'll get it, I'll get it. And then she doesn't tell me. So I'm not moaning. But how cute, right? How cute. And I will show you all of this styled up. I promise you faithfully. And when he's had his surgery. The next thing she got me, I'm, I'm taking it all out of a washing up bowl because I haven't been able to find a rectangle washing up bowl in the Canaries anywhere for love nor money you know so the next thing she got me look at this look at this wreath hello hello why haven't you got tea in your hands because I was just trying to get it mm -hmm. I'm going to shower and then you'll get one okay boo oh I was like framed yeah. when we were talking then this little I don't think they call it a wreath I don't know what they call it because someone got the spectacles on. Don't know. But six pounds, where is that from? Is that B and M? I don't know. But it's cute and I know, I just know that I can change this up for all seasons. But I love it and I love the wicker on it. I love the greenage. Oh, I love it. I love it. I cannot wait to show that all styled up. Yeah. Watching that bowl. Then oh. Hang on, you have to wait for this. You just have to wait. Wait, wait. Then she got me <laughs> these little bunny egg cups. Oh, my ring light makes funny. Can you see? Can you see that? How cute. They're like cream and pink with little faces on. So she got me two of those. I love them. The next thing she got me was this. Now. I'm going to get it out for you. This. There's some things in there that I don't think was meant to be in there. This little spring wreath. I mean, I feel like I could be, you know. This little spring wreath with these tiny little... Does it say a price? No. These little gorgeous speckled eggs on there and these little like spring flowers and they're bubblegum colours. That's what they look like. So this is going to go on my door for spring. But I love it. I just love it. Honestly, she FaceTimes me whenever she goes to Primark, B&M, Wilco's, Pound Stretcher, Poundland, Home Bargains. This could have been a Home Bargains actually. I just don't know. Forgive me, I don't know, but I love it, and I love her. Next, oh, oh. she brought me these little eggs, look at them. Are they eggs? No, they're chickens. These cute little chickens, they're all like pastel colours, and they've got little feet. I don't think they're going to need, I mean, I don't think the orange feet, but the actual, <laughs> they are so cute. I love them, it doesn't tell me. I think these were 99p for four, but they are so gorgeous. I do love them. Oh, one's in the cup. Right, and oh my God. So she brought me out this. Roots of Strength from Body Shop. So she just got me onto the chamomile, like cleansing oil. I don't know if you've used it, but I love it. It's really good. So she brought me out this. I think it's a serum. I don't know. I can't see. I haven't got my spectacles on. That's for Brett. Right, now, moving on to what my mama got me. So, she went into Wilkinson's and picked me up the mug of dreams. Not mug of the day, 
mug of dreams. I have got a little foxy one like this that Lolly bought me when I was in Wilco's with her. But it's just ceramic, it's cute, it's got the sage green like rim around the bottom. But it's pretty. And this is kind of part of my spring vibes too. Now, my mum also got me this because she knows that I've just got a new office. So she bought me two separate planners. This one is making it happen. And this one is planner. Ah, oh, it couldn't come up with a better name. But yeah, this, there is one more thing that I want to show you that my sister did get me. So, I don't know if you know right, but I haven't just, she said to me probably two days ago, Kel, is there anything else I can bring over for you? Anything else that you need? Yes, Emma. Could you bring me over a dressing gown string? A dressing gown tie? So that's what she did. Now, I have been trying really hard lately to do the heatless curls. One, because I'm a lazy cow and doing my rollers every day is too much like hard work. But also because I want to look after my hair. I like to keep the length of my hair so I'm sick of heat curling it all the time and frizzling it. So I've been doing this. I'm also only washing my hair twice a week, which is difficult to do. If you're a girl that you know, constantly styles her hair, heat styles her hair. Washing your hair twice a week is hard. But Tuesdays and Saturdays are my days. So when I do that, I do my heatless curls. So I'm not going to do a tutorial on it, but it's literally this. You separate it, you tie it round, you go to bed looking like Rambo on a Tuesday night and Saturday night. Brett's favourite days of the week. But yeah, that is it, my little cherubs. That is my little haul from the UK. Honestly, I love my family coming over. You know how much I love my family coming over. But when they bring treats as pretty as that, you know what I'm saying. And they're here for two weeks right now. I get to spend two weeks with my family. For three days of it, my parents are going to drive up here and spend three days staying with us. Um, because they're... All of the family are in the centre of the island in Coleta, Castillo, and I'm the north of the island in Corileco because your girl just moved into her dream home. Um, but I really hope you guys enjoyed that video. Now I'm going to run off. It's, when am I filming this? It's like, it's ten past nine on a Wednesday night. I've just had a team training call and then I'm like, guys, I need to film this video because I need to... I need to put this stuff everywhere. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm going to do now. I'm going to go and have a nice shower, get my PJs on, and then start styling my little bits. So I'll get lots of pictures. You should have seen them all. I hope you enjoyed my video. If you did enjoy my video, please don't forget to subscribe. It means so much to me. Every time I log back on, this is how sad I am, guys. No, no judgment here. But every time I log back onto YouTube and I've gained an extra subscriber, cartwheels. I do cartwheels. I'm like, another subscriber. So yeah, please, it's free to do it. Just click the subscribe button down below. Hit the notification bell and it will tell you every time I upload. I do try to upload once a week at least. Um, but with the move, it's been a bit frantic, a bit crazy, um, but yeah, I'm working really hard on being organised and planning and now that I've got my office to work from and my filming room, um, yeah, and also I do ask for lots of advice on lots and lots of videos. So I've also got this other trick, if you get to the end of this video, please comment, please comment. scary white things that's what you've got to comment and then I know that you watch the whole video I mean I know that the only person that's going to say scary white things is Emma or probably Emma because she featured in today's video 
I'm going now. Have the best weekend, my loves, and I will see you all in the next one.